me. So today I'm actually going to be doing a review on the Daily Facial Towelettes from Kirkland, which is Costco brand. And I noticed that they discontinued, um, they're trying to sell more Kirkland products and they're trying to like discontinue a lot of the like products that they can kind of make their own of. So this is one of them and they're discontinuing the Neutrogena ones at my local Costco. This is just what it looks like. It comes in this type of box. And it's hypoallergenic, it does not irritate your skin, and it's gentle enough to use around the eyes, which I really do not agree with, and I'll go into more detail about that. Um, and this is just what it claims right now. And it's for all skin types, effectively removes eye makeup with a single towelette. And it's in a larger wipe with cucumber, calomel flower, and aloe. But this is what the package looks like for just a regular non-travel size one. And I personally really don't, okay, if you care about smell, this smells like those clean, lemony kind of wipes, but the problem is it goes on your face, so it's a little bit like you can feel the, like, it feels sticky on your skin. So I'm going to, like, now go into, like, more detail about how it feels on my skin and everything. So I'm just going to apply this to my skin so I can directly explain it to you guys. So if you guys can see my face, there's no makeup, but, um... I'm going to tell you guys right now that it does take off the makeup, but around your eyes it gets a burning and sticky sensation. Like, it cleans it off, but it gives in the creases and by your eyes. So, like, right here, and then right here, and right up here, like, I have a burning sensation and on my eyes, and it's just not a good feeling. And so, I don't really, um, sorry about my dog in the background. So I don't really recommend these to someone who is wanting, who has like sensitive skin. Like if you have tough as nails type of skin, this is the one for you. But if you don't, don't go for these. These are not the best quality personally. They, I'm going to show you with um, a new wipe. So here's a new wipe that I just pulled out. And legitimately, you can pull this apart with the, like I don't know if you guys can see this. But this, you could pull it apart and rip it. Just like that. I would definitely recommend going out and spending a little extra money on the Neutrogena ones. Um, personally, I like these. The Those ones the best. So if you if they still have those at your Costco and you like Neutrogena way, like you are a Neutrogena user already, for the makeup remover wipes, I definitely recommend to go and pick them up before they switch over. It also comes with the ones like this, and it just has a little bit different. It doesn't have this like little clampy thing that closes like a baby wipes thing. It has like a pulley thing so it's different and I'm not really sure what I think about this I personally would rather have the um, plastic on it and a case for this one because I, I personally would not like this sitting up like randomly saying Kirkland or daily facial towelettes or something and I think the size of this is a little bit big because they have so much air in it and the wipes can be longer instead. Um, the way that they package this, just I didn't really like the packaging in general, but I mean, I'm used to it now, so that's like a little bit of a plus. But I personally think that you guys are definitely better off spending your money on the Neutrogena ones because these ones automatically, I still have like a residue it leaves on your face, and it may it doesn't clean it off, and it definitely leaves it oily, but yet it's like it doesn't make it feel oily. Which I don't like the look when it when your skin looks so oily and you're and then you don't feel oily so you can't notice it you know, but other people can notice it besides you. So like besides those things, I really the only the thing that really does turn me away from this is the fact that Kirkland is a good brand in all, but I think they stepped a little too far out of their normal brand you know. Because, I mean, baby wipes are a little bit different than this, so I think that they made this more for baby wipes. Like, I personally feel like these are baby wipes instead of makeup remover wipes because it removes your makeup, but you still have makeup left. Like, it remo removes the stuff you can see, but then when I went to take a shower, I literally had, I used two, two wipes on my face, and it was just my eyes, by the way, and I used two wipes, and it still... Uh, didn't take off my mascara, which was a big problem because it was it wasn't even waterproof, and it was a scandalized, which comes off like that um, when you use makeup remover. So I was kind of upset with that, but I got over it. Um, 
I don't I don't expect you guys to get over it because this is something that's going on your face and you want your face to feel good so I know this was a short review but I don't don't recommend these I mean I might get into them and might like them a little bit more but um or I might like them less if you guys want an update on this I will tweet about it and you guys can check that out I'll have all my links down below I hope that you guys so, enjoy let's just uh, say our goodbyes so I love you guys so so much and bye